Hello again, everybody. I'm your host, Leo D. Cook, and welcome to Masterpieces of Children's Literature in Less Than a Minute. As you can see, I'm just trying to find a matching pair of shoes. I just can't seem to find one that fits. Either it's a left or right. Now, today's book is an old one, and it's a variation of the Cinderella story. The word variation means it's derived or inspired by it. The book is titled Goody Two Shoes. This book was first published in 1765, so it's a little bit older than your grandma. No one knows for sure who wrote it, but it was popular for many, many years. Now, this story is about a poor orphan girl named Marjorie. Now, if you're a fan of this show, Marjorie is one of many orphan characters in children's literature. Some examples are Oliver Twist, Anne of Green Gables, Tom Sawyer, Heidi, Little Lord Fauntleroy, Rebecca of Sunnybrook Farm, Karana of Island of the Blue Dolphins, and yes, Cinderella. Now, after the passing of Marjorie's folks, she's left with only rags and one shoe. I gotta tell you, it's tough being in shoe biz with only one shoe. <clears throat> Lucky for her, a kindly person gives Marjorie a pair of shoes. I guess that's how she got the nickname of Little Miss Goody Two Shoes, which is much better than being called Miss Bratty Von Brat Brat No Shoes. Later on, through hard work, she becomes a school teacher, and a bunch of other stuff happens. So if you want to know what else occurs to Little Miss Goody Two Shoes, I suggest you read it yourself. You'll be glad you did. I'm Leo D. Cook, and I'll see you next time on Masterpieces of Children's Literature in less than a minute. Now, if I can only find a pair of matching shoes.